What's going on friends? I just wanted to make a really quick and dirty video to show you guys that I made a cool custom vape stew theme for DNA 75C and 250C. It doesn't change any of the settings or anything in your eScribe. I'm just going to show you how to upload it. So uh, yeah, sit back and uh, it's super easy. If you don't know anything about eScribe, you'll be able to do this. Just follow along. My name's Stan and you have found the Tenacious TX Vapes channel. Okay, so the very first thing you're going to do is you're going to take your DNA mod and the proper USB slash data cable that either comes with it or a equivalent data slash USB charge cable has to be able to transfer data and you're going to plug it in and you're going to set it aside. And then what you're going to do is you're going to open up the eScribe software. When you open up the eScribe software and you plug in your device, this pops up. It says connect. It's my Warlocks Ember. I hit OK. It's going to connect. Downloading settings. So what this is doing right now is it's pulling the current theme and current settings off of my mod that I plugged into it. Okay. So what you're going to do once it's all uploaded and everything, what I like to do just in case I ever need to go back is, is I go to save and I theme and this one is the warlocks theme and I'm gonna save it right there BAM okay so now I have the current theme that's on my mod saved just in case I need to go backwards and then what you're going to do is you're going to ignore all these settings unless you actually want to modify anything through any of your profiles or anything. I'm not going to get into depth. There's plenty of good videos like DJLSB vapes. And I think Jay Hayes even does one. Um, and I think Heavy Metal Vapor and some other people do. A lot of people do a lot of videos on eScribe and how it works. I like the way the Warlocks mod works. So I don't want to change any of the settings. I want to leave it alone. Um, but I do want to change the theme on it. I don't like the way the screens and stuff look. So what I'm going to do is, is I'm going to go right here to theme. Okay. And what you need to do is you need to go down to the link in the description and download the vape stew theme with the link that I provided down there. If you want to use that. Okay. So you go to load theme, bam, you select the vape stew theme that you just downloaded open. Okay. That's it. That's everything. And then you hit upload settings to device. Give it a second. It's going to go through the whole spiel here. Go, 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 go. Go with the smile. All right, this is going to take forever. <clears throat> Bingo, bango, that's it. Now your mod has, it has everything on it that it's supposed to. If I can, it's still plugged in. I'm not going to unplug it yet, but you can see, and I'll show it to you when we go back up top. But if you want to see what's included, just go down right here to Theme Designer, and you can go to Screens, and you can see all the different screens that are in this, all the different settings that are, you know, included. And if you have any information or anything that you want on there that's not on there, you can modify it yourself. Um, but currently, that's what's on there, and this is the simplest way just to change the theme and not change anything else. Uh, you just go to load theme, pick the one you want to load, hit upload settings to device, and then the battery situation and all the settings and everything stay the same and it uploads this theme. So that's it. Hit disconnect. Once you hit disconnect, you can unplug it. And now, one, two, three, four, five. There it is. Ta-da! See, do you even vape, bro, with no atomizer? Do you even vape, bro? <laughs> and then one, two, three, four, five. Vape stew. And then it's got all kinds of stuff in there. Um, on the main screen, you've got your wattage puff counter settings, your profile right there. You've got your pair battery thing uh, for when it's hooked up to the USB, your battery percentage, and a locking resistance option as well. Um, so 
that's all the main stuff that's on there and i may modify it and change it if you want the most current up-to-date file you can get it on the facebook group it'll be it'll be a there'll be a post that's pinned with the theme file and everything in there um, but the one that's currently available you can go down and get it in the description so yeah that's fun just a way if you want to you know if you want to show the world hey i support vape stew and it's on my mod and my mod tells me to vape on friends every time i push the button uh <laughs> have fun with me it's a good time you guys stay safe you guys have a fantastic rest of your weekend and remember vape on friends